yep, here we go. So we're going to take this massive cowl and make it fit my face. And this is the before. So besides the cowl, what are you going to need? Well, you're going to need sandpaper, scissors, Velcro, super glue, and I suggest Gorilla Glue Gel, and some craft foam. For this particular cowl, we're going to cut the outer neck guard off all the way around. And then what we're going to do is we're going to follow this line and we're going to cut the center neck part out. So after cutting those pieces out, you should have something like this, which is very akin to the film. So basically what's going to happen is we're going to use the sandpaper, scuff up the inside of the cowl so that the glue has a better adhesion. And then we're going to take the craft foam, put strips on the center neck part, and then put the opposite Velcro on inside. I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. All right, now that we've got that done, this is what it looks like. So you've got foam on the back side and the Velcro on the outside, and then the other half of the Velcro on the inside. So we're gonna put this together and see what it looks like. All right, so here it is. It's nice and snug to my chin area, but as we can see, there's still a lot of space up top. So what are we missing? Well, one thing I forgot to mention was cushion foam. So basically what we're gonna do next is we're gonna cut up some of this foam and we're gonna put it inside the top part so that the top fits better and then everything should snug together. So basically just cut strips and then lay the strips in wherever you need. So here's a messy cut of the foam, but I keep it between uh, a half inch and three quarters of an inch and then I cut it into smaller pieces and fit it into the cowl to what fits my particular head and what's comfortable. And here we go. So this is with one strip of foam here, one across the back, and uh, it's pretty snug. So it went from being completely loose to a decent comfortable fit and it looks pretty good actually as is still might cut the nose out I've left it in just because it keeps this together I'm afraid if I cut that out it will kind of get loose but yeah turns out really well and if you really want to you can add some foam craft foam on the inside of this to stiffen this up and then add velcro oops I put that on upside down put Velcro like here to hold that and then you can still move or whatever. Um, but yeah, that's how you can make a Battenson cowl fit your face better. Now, um, I'll be doing something like this to my Hernandez FX cowl when it comes in, but I'll be taking a lot more time with it and being a little bit more careful. But anyways, hopefully this helps.